Your fault. What? No. No, that's not what I'm saying. Just... <gasps> this baby is a problem. I don't know why you would have a baby during this sorry. time. I don't want to slow us down. Can I just have a minute? Uh, yeah. Take a minute. Thank you. <laughs> yeah. Alvin was supposed to be here for this. Is Alvin... He's dead is what he is. Thanks to that fucking madman back there. Kenny might know what to do. He had a family. Let's hope he made it to the middle. <coughs> What are you going to do with it? What do you mean? She's by pretty that? damn pregnant. Oh, I'm sorry. Just making conversation. It was nothing. Watch what you're no. saying, man. What do you mean by that? Do with what? Oh shit. My baby? I'm just looking at the worst case scenario. You and Clem won't be able to raise a baby by yourselves. Not out here. I just mean it's going to need food and you know, other stuff. Yeah. And and there are just some helpless things in this world. You can't uh -oh. always protect them. <clears throat> I don't know if you should have said that. And you assume I won't be capable enough. Just of course you won't. Some angry loner who doesn't care about anyone but herself doesn't mean you know better than me. Hey, I've seen it before. Back when it started, me and my sister, we what? were... She died? I don't need your pity. Oh, damn. You don't... You don't have the right... Jane! Shit. Shit. Alright, for all those who just started tuning in, um, I replayed this, uh, my second time playing this, this episode. Uh, it's, we've been playing for like, literally like five minutes, so you didn't miss much. Shit. Jane, wait. <clears throat> Damn it. Look what you did, Rebecca. <laughs> Killer. <laughs> we can't just sit here doing nothing. I know, I know. They'll be here soon. Oh, at least Mike's Holy okay. Shit. It had been so long. We were starting to worry no one else would make it. Well, besides. Yo! Now, hopefully, we can figure out a plan. Wait. Yo, oh, Alice. damn it. You guys see that? Yo, Mike's ear. Yo, right there. Oh, wait, you can't see my cursor. Dude, you guys check out Mike's ear. Holy shit, I didn't notice that when I when I played, uh... Wait, when did we see him? We saw him last episode. Yo, I didn't, I didn't see his ear like that. Was it always like that? His ear got chopped off. Probably not by Walker, but what the fuck? I wonder how weird it feels if you're showering and there's like a piece of meat missing. Mike's a trooper, man. I tried to talk to Ken. He flipped out on me. He started yelling. Someone must have been hungry. I know, must have been Carver. Probably didn't mean it. Crazy shit. It was scary. Well, at least Kenny won't be pissed off at Clementine. I hate to say it. For chopping off Sarita's arm. Is, uh, is he going to take care of her? Jane! I know it's not pretty. But it's better than the alternative. It's not our decision to make. But it's the one that's gotta be made. We're already up the creek enough without a walker to worry about. Just let me talk to him first. Clementine's gotta do everything in this. Everyone else is... It's alright, It's like, I don't know what to say. Okay. <coughs> gonna be here with you. Right till the end. Hi, Kenny. Yeah, Joker, I did, but then when I went to restart this episode, um, it said something about, like, select the save file. So I selected the save file, and I think, I don't know what happened, but um, I guess the save files were messed up or something. I only had one save file, and I thought that I didn't chop off her arm or something like that. But I don't know, it, it doesn't really matter to me. This is another way to, uh, to experience the episode. Last time, I did chop off her arm, and Kenny was shit pissed at me. This time he's not, so that's good. He's just pissed at zombies now. <clears throat> you think I don't know what y'all are whispering about over there? 
I said we just wanted a little fucking time alone. To say goodbye. <clears throat> shh, shh, shh. It's okay, babe. It's okay. We're gonna get through this. We're gonna do what we gotta do. We're gonna play the shit hand that this shit world dealt us. Kenny, I'm so sorry about you Sarita. Hear that, babe? Clem says she's sorry. Don't that make you feel better? There was nothing I could do. Seeing how things turned out, I think I might have preferred if you do nothing. Yeah, I know, right? What? I did do nothing. I tried to save look her. At her. I said, look at her. She is going to die. What the fuck did I do? You think because you're a little girl, you can just get people killed and no one will care? That because you're sorry, it'll all magically go away? Okay, never mind. He's still pissed at me. How it works. <laughs> I guess there's no way to, uh... Just leave us alone to say goodbye. There's no way to make it so Kenny's not angry at you. I'm going crazy just sitting here not doing anything. Just give it time, Mike. It's still early. Clem, how'd it go? Not good. You could hear. Kenny's really mad at me. Clem, you can't just expect him to bounce back. That man's going through. <coughs> at least you try. Still. Doesn't exactly help us figure out what we're gonna do now. We got no food, no water. It's getting damn cold, and we're losing daylight fast. When the others get back, they'll know what to do. Luke will have a plan. The dark Ken will have a plan. Mike, honey. Mike's got a point. You can't just keep sitting around waiting. Things are difficult enough right now, and soon you'll have a baby on your hands too. What? Suddenly you're pretending to be concerned? We should go find Luke and Sarah. If they're in trouble, we might be able to help them. Whoa. Clementine. I think Clementine means just fine, Luke. Everything, after all this, if there's any chance they're still alive, we need to take it. I'll go. Clem can come with me. Yeah. Yo, I'm down. We'll make a good team. Thank you. Listen, Rebecca. If anything goes wrong here, you got something to protect yourself? I've got this. You don't think I can do it? bullets? I don't know. But you better keep that close. Come on, Clem. Who's Nick? Look, I'm gonna level with you. You should know that oh, yeah? your friends, that's a shot in the dark. We're gonna get some levels then? Level up? Well, then why'd we come out here? I wanted to talk to you, away from them. You wouldn't have made it this far if you weren't smart, but I still... I just gotta warn you. That group is cracking. I've seen it before. Hey, what? Hey, peeps. I'm here because I'm up to this part. I'll be lurking and I followed. All right, sweet Bernard. Thanks, man. I appreciate the follow. And, well... Nick is a guy who killed Walter's friend. Oh, my God. Who the hell's Walter again? Oh. Oh, right, Nick. Nick face in the statue. Really? That's his face? I don't think so, man. You can see how insignificant the characters are. I totally forgot who Nick and Walter were. <laughs> A lot of times, it's better to be on your own. I know you see what I'm talking about. You don't want to be here when they start turning on each other. They're not bad people. But there have been problems before. I don't always agree with what they say or do. Neither do I. Look at Kenny. I don't even know where to begin with what a liability he is. And Rebecca's 
situation is not making things better back there. You get enough broken people together, and all you're gonna get are broken <coughs> decisions. Have you just kept to yourself this whole time? Of course not. But sometimes you gotta. Yeah, Bernard. Um, I I do think they kind of look similar, and their personalities are similar. Like they're like lone wolves kind of thing. Strong, like you know, women take care of themselves. <laughs> but at least in the first one, episode, uh, not episode one, season one. You meet her like in the in like episode four or something like that when you get to town finally. In the hard way. I'm trying to save you that trouble. For what it's worth, I like most of the people in your crew, but groups fall apart. People get killed. Then why did you bring me with you? He had the ninja woman. The tools you need to make it. Like your jacket, it looks warm, but. A walker will bite right through that. Plus, it's an ugly jacket. Jamie had a good leather one. Wish I still had it. You could have. Aww, she's sad. Let me give you a hug. I always wanted a sister. I used to make my babysitter Sandra play a game that we were secret sisters. <laughs> it was. Stupid kid stuff. You know, being a big sister is, well, it's funny. It's really easy. How is it funny? Me. Oh? You know, hide her toys, make fun of her bad haircut, give her the bad haircut on purpose. I mean, I did put the gum there. I figured I should get it out. Wow. Really what it's Just like, like Bart, what Bart did to Lisa. No, no. It's not all bad, but what could I do? She thought I was her best friend. I could no, I didn't kill Sarita. Punished. <laughs> Every summer we'd go to this amusement park in Virginia, but the best part wasn't the rides. It was that nobody knew us there, and I'd, I'd pretend we weren't sisters, just friends. <clears throat> Why? I don't understand that. Why would you not want to be? Why would you pretend you're All friends right. and not sisters? But these walkers got some good stuff. That one's not coming back. See what else he's got. Yeah, you should check them out. But you know why, right? Only because they're fresh. Take a look. Old walkers are a waste of time. They're holding credit cards and busted <coughs> old pagers. But these ones weren't walkers all that long ago. They were survivors. They might have useful stuff. Oh, right in the eyeball. See what else he's got. I'll check this one. All right, let's go looting. Get some EXP. Hold on. Get some loot. Ammo's getting hard to come by. Things aren't going to get better. Okay. If you say so. Find anything? Driver's licenses. Two of them. Well, I guess some people just can't leave the past behind. Hmm. Man, I wish Lee was still with us. One of my favorite, uh, my second favorite character aside from uh, Clementine. Smart haircut. Huh. <laughs> Thanks. Thanks to Lee. So, has your crew always been so dysfunctional? You fit in there, but you weren't like them. I was with a different group before. That one worked better, I think. That was when I got my hair cut like this. That's it. A nail file. These things are great. Sharpen a blade, strike a flint. Jamie always had one in her purse. I jab my hand when I went reaching in. Maybe you should reach in then. Oh, in the ear. I think it was his ear drum. Be sure with these things. Here, give me a hand. Are you serious? You need my help to 
roll his body over. 